On the 9th of December, we published the ESO's first standalone Rio 2 business plan, and this is a really exciting milestone for us. We'd like to really thank you, our stakeholders, for all the input you've given us to that. It's been absolutely vital in getting us to this point to deliver a business plan that delivers what you want us to be doing in the way that you want us to be doing it. Rio 2 is the first opportunity for the ESO to set out as a standalone company exactly what we're going to do over the next two years with a five-year strategy and a 10-year vision and agree with Ofgem what we're going to get paid for that. We've developed the business plan over the course of two years by engaging with hundreds of stakeholders who've given us some brilliant input on what we should be doing and how we should be doing it and we've really appreciated all of that effort. Theme 1 is all about system operation. It's about ensuring that we've got the tools and the systems in place to operate in a zero carbon world and the people with the capabilities to operate those systems. And that really means making sure that we can work with a lot more people as the system becomes more decentralised and there are a lot more participants. Theme 2 is about making sure that the markets are in place so that we can facilitate all of those new market players to bring forward services to us and also ensure that the codes and governance arrangements um, facilitate the, the increased number of participants in that zero carbon world. Theme three is about competition in networks and about the networks option, network options assessment, building on the, the, the high levels of consumer benefit that that currently drives and expanding it out to a wider range of network requirements and also to more participants. And then the four, fourth area is whole electricity system. And that's covering things such as the network access planning, customer connections, and how we work with other network um, providers across the system. In the second half of December, Ofgem will be publishing a call for evidence in which they'll invite stakeholders to tell them what they think of our business plan. We'd really like you to tell them what you think is great, but also please tell them what you think we should be doing differently or could be better. That will feed through along with um, our user group, so the ESO Rio2 stakeholder group and Ofgem cha Ofgem's challenge group um, to Ofgem's open hearings, which are taking place in March and April 2020. And there you will potentially have the opportunity to ask us questions about our business plan and give us some challenge on it. That then feeds through to Ofgem's draft determinations in July, which will also include a consultation on our incentive scheme and then through to the final determinations in December 2020, before we get onto the exciting bit of delivering what we've set out in our business plan in April 2021. To see the full version of the business plan or to get in contact, we're very happy to talk to you about what's in the plan. Please have a look at the Rio pages of the ESO website.